Okay. Right, so in here, you can see the range of motion that we're talking about in here. And the sideways range of movement is quite limited. You can see where it actually so hits. So what I'll probably actually end up doing is widening this out a little bit more to maintain the, the look of it sort of thing, but to give it a little bit more sideways motion so that it can it can cross its legs across quite well this way, but the range of motion in the opposite direction is not nearly as good. But I freed up that joint a bit more and it's it's tracking a lot better there now as well.